Chapter 1 Periodic Table Periodic Properties and Variations of Properties Introduction Dear friends, in class 9th, we have learned that matter around us is present in the form of elements, compounds and mixtures and the elements contain atoms of only one type. Hope you remember that. Do you know how many elements are known till date? At present, 114 elements are known to us. Around the year 1800, only 30 elements were known. All these had seemingly different properties. As different elements were being discovered, scientists gathered more and more information about the properties of these elements. They found it difficult to organize all that was known about the elements. They started looking for some pattern in their properties on the basis of which they could study such a large number of elements with ease. Dobriner's Triads In the year 1817, a German scientist, Dobriner, suggested that properties of elements are related to their atomic masses. He made groups of three elements each, having similar chemical properties, and called them triads. He arranged the three elements in a triad in an increasing order of atomic mass and showed that the atomic mass of the middle element was approximately equal to the mean of the atomic masses of the other two elements. However, all the known elements could not be classified into the Dobriner's triads. For example, in the triad lithium, sodium and potassium, the actual atomic mass of lithium is 6.9 and the actual atomic mass of potassium is 39.1. Therefore, mean atomic mass of sodium is 6.9 plus 39.1 divided by 2, which equals 23. So, actual atomic mass of sodium is 23. 2. In the triad, calcium, strontium and barium, the actual atomic mass of calcium is 40.1, the actual atomic mass of barium is 137.3 and the mean atomic mass of strontium is 40.1 plus 137.3 divided by 2, that is 88.7, while the actual atomic mass of strontium is 87.6. 3. In the triad, chlorine, bromine and iodine, the actual atomic mass of chlorine is 35.5, the actual atomic mass of iodine is 126.9, the mean atomic mass of bromine is 35.5 plus 126.9 divided by 2, that is 81.2, while the actual atomic mass of bromine is 79.9. Newland's Law of Octaves The English scientist John Newlands correlated the atomic masses of elements to their properties in a different way. In the year 1866, Newlands arranged the elements known at that time in an increasing order of their atomic masses. He found that every eighth element had properties similar to those of the first. For example, sodium is the eighth element from lithium and both have similar properties. Also, magnesium shows similarity to beryllium and chlorine shows similarity with fluorine. Newlands compared the similarity with the octaves in music. He called the similarity observed in the eighth and the first element as the law of octaves. If you want to see all the chapters in this format, then call us in the description of the number. Mendeleev's Periodic Table The Russian scientist Dmitry Mendeleev developed the periodic table of elements during the period 1869 to 1872 AD. 
Mendeleev's periodic table is the most important step in the classification of elements. Mendeleev considered the fundamental property of elements, namely the atomic mass, as standard and arranged 63 elements known at that time in an increasing order of their atomic masses. Then he transformed this into the periodic table of elements in accordance with the physical and chemical properties of these elements. Mendeleev organized the periodic table on the basis of the chemical and physical properties of the elements. These were the molecular formulae of hydrides and oxides of the elements, melting points, boiling points and densities of the elements and their hydrides and oxides. Mendeleev found that the elements with similar physical and chemical properties repeat after a definite interval. On the basis of this finding, Mendeleev stated the following periodic law. Properties of elements are periodic function of their atomic masses. The vertical columns in the Mendeleev's periodic table are called groups, while the horizontal rows are called periods. Mosley, 1912. In 1912 AD, the English scientist Henry Mosley demonstrated, with the help of the experiments done using X ray tube, that the atomic number Z of an element corresponds to the positive charge on the nucleus or the number of the protons in the nucleus of the atom of that element. This revealed that atomic number is a more fundamental property of an element than its atomic mass. Accordingly, the statement of the modern periodic law was stated as follows. Properties of elements are a periodic function of their atomic numbers. Modern periodic table, long form of the periodic table. Mendeleev had arranged elements in the periodic table on basis of increasing atomic weights. Mosley modified Mendeleev's periodic table and stated that the basis of classification of elements be according to increasing atomic numbers and not atomic weights, since physical and chemical properties of elements depend on the number of electrons and their arrangement. Atomic number is equal to the number of electrons in the energy shells of an atom. Hence, atomic number is the fundamental property of an element. Modern Periodic Law Arrangement of elements in the periodic table is thus based on the modern periodic law, which states that physical and chemical properties of elements are periodic functions of their atomic number. Salient Features of the Modern Periodic Table Periodic table is based on basic fundamental property, atomic number. The position of an element correlates with its electronic configuration. Elements are arranged in increasing order of atomic numbers in seven horizontal rows called periods and 18 vertical columns called groups. Completion of each period is logical since each period begins with an element having one electron in the outermost shell and ends with zero group elements having completely filled outer shell. Thus, a transition from metallic to non-metallic character is seen across a period. In groups, each vertical column accommodates elements with the same outer electronic configuration hence having similar properties. 18 vertical columns consists of groups 1 to 17 and 18 zero group. Groups 1, 2 and 13 to 17, first A to 7th A, are called normal elements. Groups 3 to 12, that is first B to 7th B and 8th, are called Transition elements. Group 18, 0, at extreme right, contains noble or inert gases. Separation of elements. Reactive metals are placed in group 
one that is first a and two that is second a transition elements metals are placed in the middle non metals are placed in the upper right corner of the periodic table in period gradual change in properties is seen with increase in atomic number in the periodic table this is called periodicity of elements periodicity in properties that is recurrence in properties are seen with elements belonging to the same subgroup in the periodic table after a difference of 2 8 18 or 32 in atomic numbers due to recurrence of similar valence shell electronic configuration periods in the modern periodic table let's have a look at the first three periods in the modern periodic table period numbers 1 2 3 etc signifies number of electron shells of an element period 1 elements example h1 have one shell period 2 elements example li3 have two shells period 3 elements example na11 have three shells and so on periods of modern periodic table there are bridge elements in period 2 bridge elements show similarities in properties diagonally with the period of the next group agar aap apne syllabus ke sare chapters is format mein dekhna chahte hain to hame description mein diye gaye number par call kare aise hi aur educational videos dekhne ke liye hamare channel home revise ko subscribe kare